Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, David M. coming at you here with another video. Uh, first one in quite a few weeks. I uh, just have not had time to do it. Uh, between the baseball season, between the playoffs and hockey, there's just, there's been no time. I uh, can't stop watching that stuff. And actually, as I am filming this, uh, I'm going to try to do this really quick and in one take because uh, we're waiting for overtime in the uh, Colorado-Dallas game. So, uh had an awesome overtime game, uh, two overtime game tonight. Uh, Rangers and Canes, uh, it was a great one. I'll talk about that in a minute. Uh, what I want to show tonight is, um, first of all, a few pickups that I had uh, a little while back. Gosh, probably some of these a couple months ago even. Just haven't had a chance to show. And then I'm going to show some LCS stuff. Uh, so let's just start off here. First one for the 80s. Hall of Famers. We've got the Doug Gilmore rookie. It's in an SGC5. I'm not sure how, but uh, anyway, this is the Opeachy. I uh, was really happy to add this one for a great price. There's Doug Gilmore there. And then we have um, let's go with this one. This is a, a big one for me. Um, again, a player who's younger and I will never own. Uh, so we'll pick up other variations of his rookie, but the 2015 Opeachy Platinum Marquee Rookie, Connor McDavid. And this is a beautiful card. This one's a, a nine there, but just, uh, I apologize for my camera, but really shiny, really beautiful, beautiful example of this card of McJesus. I was thrilled to add that one. And then also... You know, I like JT Miller. Uh, I hate that the, uh, the Canucks beat my Preds, but that's all right. Uh, I'm hoping they take it to Edmonton. We'll see. Uh, but anyway, added his Young Guns Canvas card for dirt cheap. Man, his cards go for nothing, but uh, we're still to add that one too. So now, on to some LCS pickups. And I actually have a ton of them. So I'm going to split it up into multiple videos. Uh, real quick story about my LCS. So... Um, they don't have a lot of hockey, never have. And I've gone through and I'm, I'm probably, or at least what they've told me is I'm pretty much the one guy there that looks at the hockey boxes, which they've, again, only had a few and I've gone through them and I've cherry picked out everything I wanted. Well, they had bought, and again, this is a few weeks ago, they had bought a huge collection, um, you know, mostly baseball and football and stuff, but there was some hockey in it. And I walk in and there's a huge box of hockey laying on this table that I'd never seen before. And I'm like, oh man, when did you guys get this? Like, well, actually we're packing it up to send to Com C. They basically sell a lot of their hockey on Com C. And um, they really, so they don't really care about hockey. Like they know, obviously, you know, young guns they look for and that kind of stuff. And, and you know, more vintage guys and anything Gretzky. But other than that, they don't really know and they don't really care. It's not worth their time. And they had this box, and I was like, hey, man, can I take a look through that? And they're like, yeah. And so, you know, I was thinking maybe I could save them some time and buy some stuff. And so I, I searched through there, and I found some things that I liked. And I was going to see what they, what kind of deal they'd make me. And, you know, I don't sit there in the LCS and look up prices on my phone. But I kind of knew from what I picked out that, you know, I would have been thrilled if they had said, hey, 50 bucks, something like that. I was shocked and they said 20 bucks for all these cards that I'm about to show you. And like, you know, a couple of them, like one of them is about a $20 card anyway. The other one's about a $40 card. Um, you know, but they sold me every card I'm about to show you. They sold me for 20 bucks total. So without further ado, first of all, I'm going to start off with this guy who was a fantasy stud for me the last couple years and also was the hero of tonight's Rangers game. It's Vincent Trocheck. They had two SP Authentic on card autos in there. And these are just beauties right here. Flip it to the back there. 1718 and 1819. But Vincent Trocheck, two on card autos. Okay, from SP Authentic. We have once again JT Miller. SP game used. This one is numbered out of 265. There's the back there. 
beautiful card. We have another JT Miller, this one, SPX, number to 299. This is a thick one here. There's the back of that one. Another from SPX, same set, Bob, Sergey Bobrovsky, who had an amazing playoffs until this uh, round one game against Boston where he got lit the hell up. But anyway, this one's numbered to 299. These are just beautiful cards here. Now we get to the uh, expensive couple of cards. First off, we have the Upper Deck Premier Rookie, Elias Patterson, number 290, I'm sorry, 199, all right? And then we have, finally, I keep knocking the camera, this beauty from SPX, uh, Jason Robertson, SPX Rookie Jersey patch there, guaranteed to have been worn by the featured player. Now, probably was worn for like a promo shoot, not in a game, but whatever. Still though, a rookie patch from Jason Robertson. All that stuff, all this, right? It was 20 bucks. I couldn't believe it. And I, I love these two autos. But anyway, it just to me, that was a great deal. Um, and I've got a lot more I'm gonna show from the LCS in the next video, and the ones I'm going to show in the next video all were a dollar a piece. And again, some of them are worth considerably more than that. Not that I really care that much, like I'm reselling them, but I'm just saying, like, man, I'm finding some deals there on hockey. Anyway, and yes, I have picked up some baseball cards and all that stuff. I've also lost out on a bunch of baseball cards, um, and I will show baseball soon enough. But right now, we're just we're in fever pitch with the playoffs here. So speaking of that, I need to get the TV back on because based on the time on this and the time that was left um, in the intermission, uh, it's about to be starting back up. So let me get off here. I appreciate everyone watching. Take care. We'll catch you next time.